based on the strong energy I feel right here, I know the body must be in this area. So you really believe in this voodoo witchcraft stuff? It's not witchcraft or voodoo art. It has to do with energy we already possess in our bodies. Energy doesn't die, so therefore I can still feel the energy even if the victim has perished. I don't get it. How can you feel it? Look, I don't feel anything over here. Well, not all of us were given the gift to feel energy. In my culture and family, we have a belief system of, of being more connected with nature. And I come from a long line of energy healers known as curanderos. Alice, you have completely lost me. And I don't think I'm ever going to understand your culture. Look alive, here comes the boss. Cruz, I need you to begin searching this specific area and also start taking some ground samples. Right away, Dr. Knight. And Mr. Bradbury, if you would start photographing these footprints here and uh, also be on standby if Ms. Cruz finds anything. Copy that, Dr. Knight. Based on these footprints right here, I think it's highly probable that we find the body here in this area. Yes, ma'am. Dr. Knight, I yes. was focusing more in this area. Why that area, Ms. Cruz? Let's just say it's a hunch, Dr. Knight. Miss Cruz, this is a science. I don't work on intuition. Talked about that earlier. That's what I said, Dr. Knight. So you just, just basically in this general area. Dr. Knight, I found something. The remains of a hand. Based on the metacarpals and phalanges, this is definitely a woman in her early 20s. We have an official homicide now. 